the, the key is always to focus on your own emotion. So the problem with going through an, analyt an, an analytical process with your parent is that what you're doing is you're still using your mind to resolve issues. The truth is that the law of, co the law of attraction sorry, will bring to you triggers to identify any emotions that exist within you. Where they come from really is immaterial in the end. Yeah. The main thing to do is to go into the law of attraction, what it's bringing to you, the trigger, and just focus on the emotion you feel in that triggered situation. When you do that, you will eventually get to what the cause was if you allow the emotion to come to surface and, and become present. So if, for instance, a situation causes a rage to be triggered in you, go outside, beat the hell of out, out of a you know, punching bag or something, and then allow yourself to step underneath into the grief with it as you're doing it, and you'll find through that process, you'll become aware somehow as to whether it was something that occurred to you in your life or something that was multi-generational. And it, to be honest, doesn't matter. All that matters is you release the emotion. That's all that matters. And once you release the emotion, you won't no longer have the law of attraction, so you won't get trigger events to trigger that emotion anymore. So that's what tells you you've released the emotion. And on top of that, the benefit to your children is instantaneous, whether they are alive or yet to be born. Yep. So that, that's the main thing to bear in mind. So don't, don't need to use this thing very much in the process. All you need to do is allow the trigger to present to you the emotion. And the emotion then is just needing to be experienced. And once the emotion is experienced and released, the law of attraction won't trigger anything in you anymore. <coughs>